award is being presented to the man who did <laughs> his part to help catch the Brooklyn subway shooter. News 12 New Jersey's Chris Keating is in Prospect Park right here in New Jersey for the accolades being given out. You know, Chris, uh, I saw him and he's, he seems he strikes mm -hmm. me as a very humble guy. Very humble and very sincere, Roxanne, and very serious about helping out the community because that's believes that's what he did, and certainly he believes in what he did. We can tell you, Zach Tahan is from Union City originally, but last week at the time he was working in New York City's East Village. He looked around and saw a face that he recognized, and he realized it was the subway shooter, which is why he immediately spoke up and grabbed the nearest police officer, and the arrest was made. As we said, he is from Union City, but he was in Prospect Park today to be given the key to this city. Now, he was in the East Village last Wednesday when he was spotting the alleged shooter on the street. Frank James had been hiding from police after the shooting on board the N train. He actually called police to tell them where he could be found. And James took to the streets and was seen by Tahan and others who immediately recognized that wanted man. We can tell you Tahan is Syrian and Muslim, which is why today he's being praised by both the New Jersey Council on American Islamic Relations, as well as the mayor of Prospect Park, who is also Syrian. I think if somebody is going to see what I see in New York City, he's going to do the same I did. He's a hero to all of us. Zach represents what our humanity is all about. Zach, I want to say thank you for your courage uh, and for your quick thinking. Zach Tahan was recently honored by New York City's mayor, along with five other civilians who saw the subway shooter on the street and also spoke up. They were all given proclamations by the mayor and the police in New York City. In that shooting, unfortunately, 10 people were shot. In all, 19 were injured. None of the injuries were fatal. Roxanne? Uh Chris, can I ask you a quick question? Do you know if he's going to get a cut of that, uh, that $50,000 reward? I don't know if you know that or not, but if you do, you can weigh in for us. I do. He announced the other day that he and those five that were honored by New York City's police department are all splitting up that $50,000 reward.